Hey guys, I'm Howie with Hobie, and I'm gonna show you how to swap out the standard fin that comes with your Mirage Drive Compass Kayak to a turbo fin. Now, if you're fishing in deep water and covering a lot of ground when you're fishing, the turbo fin might be a good idea for you. Some guys that are fishing in shallow settings prefer the standard fin so they can get full propulsion in really shallow settings. Our turbo fin upgrade kit comes with two larger turbo fins and two longer fin masts for the upgrade. Even though you will feel a little bit more resistance on the pedals with the turbo fins, you will be able to accomplish the same speed and performance at a slower cadence. Some users prefer this feeling and some don't, but you will be able to get that extra performance when you need it. The first thing we need to do is remove both of these fins. So we're gonna start by removing this split ring and clevis pin so that we can slide the fins off of the fin mast. Now to remove the standard fin mast, you're gonna use the flat that's built into the mast and a wrench, a pair of vice grips works too, um, to turn counterclockwise. And it's gonna take a little bit of force because you need to break free the factory installed Loctite that's used on the initial install. Before you thread the turbo fin masts into the drive, you're gonna to wanna to place a couple drops of the included Loctite in the turbo fin kit onto the threads at the top of the fin masts. Tighten it up by turning the fin mast clockwise. Once the turbo fin masts are threaded into the drive, then you can simply slip the turbo fin onto the fin mast I chose the gray turbo fin, just personal preference, but we also offer the fin kit in red and blue. Once the fin is slid all the way up on the fin mast, you're gonna need to insert the clevis ring and pin to secure the fin. You can use the edge of the clevis pin to help you open the ring and thread it on. They even make a handy split ring plier tool for opening up these type of split rings. If you're having a little trouble threading the split ring onto the clevis pin, this can be a really great device. I'm all set to hit the water with my upgraded fins. Thanks for watching. Visit Hobie.com and check out our YouTube channel for additional installation videos and upgrades.